Hello YouTube, my name is Woodsy and today we're back in Corpse Party and we just made it to the second wing of the building. I don't really know what other second wing there would be, but there's a second wing, that's for sure. Um, rattle, rattle. Right. So, uh, yeah, there's that. We're gonna go in this way. Shouldn't have went in that way. No, okay. Let's see what we got. Boys Laboratory, any and all students responsible for damaging these facilities will be severely reprimanded. I hear something. Really? What is up with, like... It's okay, girl. Don't worry. I hope her, I hope her bladder doesn't explode. That would be terrifying. And a really shitty way to go. Way to get rid of the uh, the darkness. Great effect there. <laughs> there we go. That works a little bit better. Tiny bit scarier when you know there's actual darkness instead of it just being like, "Hey man, here's the uh, here's the floor. You want to see it? That's cool. All right. Anything scary in here? No. You good? All right. Here. Yeah. 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 Okay. Let's go through here. No, maybe that's just how it's supposed to be. Um, something's telling me. Oh, I'll probably be able to like bring those back up one day. Girls' lavatory. No one authorized teasing or trickery. Anyone caught lurking around will be severely punished. That's not good. I don't want to be punished. I don't want to be punished. One. Oh, it's another one of those. Okay, I still have no idea. What's this one gonna say? Three? Heavenly Host Elementary School notice school closure, 10 18, 1975, due to the reputation earned from repeated tragic ac incidents and accidents in and around the school. Plans for its abolition have been finalized. There's a sharp decline in registration and attendance since the initial incidents, indicating the school board taking its time to end. We sincerely regret to announce Heavenly Host Elementary School closed the store for the last time on November the 18th, 1975. It is through my own vices that a disdainful decision has come to pass, and for that, I must offer my deepest apologies for all those who are affected. To any teachers, teaching staff, Heavenly Host Elementary School, Principal Takamine Yanagi Hori. God, my Korean is so much better than my Japanese, that's for sure. I did try learning Japanese at one point, but... An art room? Plaster bus, cheap mass produced, but it's useful for still life. Paintings? Did I just hear a sound? Watercolor paints. Palette knives, painting, what? Okay. Anything over there? No? Okay. What? Um. I don't recognize the school uniform, but she looks like a living person. Sorry, I keep... I don't know if that actually is affecting it in the video. It does. Okay, I'm sorry about that. We should talk to her. Yeah, we should. Hi. Um, we're students from school called Kisaragi Academy, and uh, we performed this weird ritual with some of my classmates, lost consciousness, we woke up and found ourselves trapped here. Our expression is changing, something's wrong. Female students staring intently at the corner room, opening and closing her mouth rapidly as if chanting an incantation. Yeah. Please, no jump scares. Yeah, fuck that. We're gonna nope right out of there like I've never noped before. I'm getting really creeped out. The first two chapters were kind of like meh when it came to horror. This one's a bit different. 
Oh no. Oh, is that the same room? Okay, okay, that's the same room. <sighs> I thought we had a teleporting ghost child. That would have sucked. Did I already come through here? I know I went through staircases, I just don't know if I came through here. Bullet in your head? Decaying corpse sitting in the chair. Lecture in a senior high school, class 2-4, now Takahashi. I'm sorry, Kauri. I'm very sorry, but we gonna nope the fuck away from you as well. What's that say? One, one, two, three. Okay. One ten, one eleven, one eleven. What? What? Music room. The door is locked. Okay. We're gonna die. There's not a soul anywhere near the piano. Donate April 1953, Kaido, Kaido Piano Classroom. Okay. Not weird in the least bit. What's weird is there wasn't a door for the other side. Okay. Oh, okay, there it was. Where am I? I don't remember where I am. This this place is kind of big. Okay, okay, I did a full loop. Jesus. Turn that down a bit. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, now we're going to go off and explore a different part. Um, I have a feeling I still have to talk to that girl, and I really, really, really don't want to. We went up last time, so now we're going down. Those are victims' memoirs, aren't they? Female student court slides sprawled out on the floor. There are a couple of scraps of paper and bony hand on her... Bleh. Luck is fickle, but I still have faith in it. That good luck charm, I know it's stupid, but I truly believe it works. So I know I'll say this again now, and if anyone else finds me finds this letter, please wish her good luck for me. Kauri Kimura, class two four, Lexern High. Well, we found Kauri. Oh God, four out of five. Where'd three out of five go? Cold. Hurts to move fingers. No strength right on desk. Cannot talk or see friend. Tendon and leg cut. Bleeding badly. Fuck that. So then we're not going to read the victim's memoirs. Simple as that. I still have a feeling we're going to have to talk to that girl again. Did we go through here? I don't remember. This is where we went. Okay, so we need to go up one more floor. Pretty sure. Pretty, 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 pretty sure. Hmm. Based on the size of these beers, be remains of a senior high school student. Seisei Academy for Girls, Class 11-3, Koito Fujiwa. Don't text me now. <laughs> Principal's Office, no entry permitted. Don't have to tell me twice. I do not want to invoke the wrath of the school. Or the spirit, or whatever it is that's holding this school. This is an interesting series, that's for damn sure. And of course, can't do anything with this. 
Torch floors completely fall in the way, making the stalls inaccessible. What is this? Okay, this is back in that floor. Um, I don't remember. I know we... I know we're going to start doing a circle. Music room, all that fun. What? 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 Hi. Missed a lot of the people who were brought here too. Yes. I have a feeling this is a really bad idea, but we're gonna keep going. Why not? Let's do it. Hey, girl, don't be a demon. So I break you like this for students from Kokisuragi Academy, and <laughs> isn't that one of the girls from our academy? What's wrong? No one believes you, not a word. Out of my way. Even when finally made other living beings, they've completely lost their moons. Guess it really isn't safe to stay here for very long. We're gonna follow her, of course. I mean, that's the only possible option. Can I use her body as, like, a pathway across to that? I don't think I'm supposed to go in the girls' bathroom anyway. It has, like, talismans and all that stuff on it. What? What now? For the love of God, what now? Damn it. Everything's fine. You handle that very well. Please don't piss yourself on the floor. Here, can you stand? Yep. What? So, maybe? Oh. Okay, let's go. Girl's bathroom. Door doesn't seem like it even has a lock, yet it's not budging in the slightest bit. Tire surface loaded with protective paper charms, spiritual confinement, Buddhist guardianship, charm, exorcism, banishment, malice, metaphysical barrier. Well, the protective seals, there's something inside. You really shouldn't hold it for this long. It's bad for the bladder. Why don't you just go in the corner? How about outside then? The woods along the walkway. This should be fine, right? Okay. Yeah, I mean, like, don't make the girl have her bladder explode. I don't want that shit to happen. I'd be. Ugh. Ugh. Just. Uh, <laughs> Or, I don't know, in that bucket. Hmm. Let me guess the door won't open. That was so loud. Very loud. You should have trouble getting over the fence, right? I think I can do it. If anything happens, you're really loud and I'll come get you, okay? Oh! Weird, I'm playing as her. Hmm. It's taller than I thought. Can I really get over it? What? Ah, oh, shit. Where'd you go? Oh, God. Now they're in two different fucking spots. Oh, God. Oh, no. Ah. 
Ah, oh, god damn it. Now they're in two different dimensions. Oh, you cried really quickly. <laughs> I probably should be making different saves, but... You know, that happens. Not going that way. Think he's in the boys' bathroom? Or worth a look, right? Nope. Nothing. Just, like, take a leak in the urinals. I know that's not how girls work, but, like, something. You should have stood outside with her, bro. May have been a little weird, but, like, seriously. <laughs> Never break up in a situation like this. Oh, hasn't horror movies taught anyone anything? Also, that music is probably the creepiest I've heard it so far. Oh god damn it, not her slash him again. You're not your sister. Say his best got dreadful baddie to think there'd be a corpse like this so close by. You're shaking, what happened to Nokshida? Gone away somewhere. You poor thing, come with me, I'll help you find him. I'll search for him by myself. Ha! Avoiding you, bitch! You ain't coming this way, is ya? Ah, shit, you're still coming. Okay, let's, uh, let's run. I wonder what he's going to do to us. Actually, I'd rather not know. <laughs> I have to hide in the boys' bathroom. Whoa. Hey. Hey. Hey now. Hey now. Door won't open. Oh, you flocking kidding me. I'm placing a glug glug sound when it comes out. Making a stuttering noise. Ah, oh, come on. Really? Oh no. Oh no. Oh, this sucks. This sucks so badly. No, 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 no. Oh god. Oh, you flock. Why? Why why does this have to happen to her? She's just a little girl. <laughs> oh, you suck so badly. Suck so badly. No. No. Give it back. Give it back. No. Oh god, it took her head off. Where? Must be night time. I must have woken up in the middle of the night again. Probably drank too much juice before bed. Ah. My baby always gets away. Br big brother, b hug back to sleep. And maybe a nice drink of peach juice too. That sounds good. No. Oh God! Don't take her head. Huh? Oh, her eye. The spirit of a little girl appears right in front of Yuka's face, glowing a bluish white. Where the left eye should be, only a gaping empty socket can be seen. No. No, don't, don't take her eye. God, no. 
disquieting snip snip sound grows even louder as the spirit draws near and presents the item she holds in her hand. Paris Owings says that she's brandishing the dangerous close to, close to Yuka's face. In her blades are dull, rusty, and caked with blood. A little doubt the following events are going to be unimaginably excruciating. Give me back my eye. The girl repeats her futile demand over and over. Bring the blades closer close to each time. Can't move. Big brother. No! Yuka's left eye offers little resistance as the jagged, blood-soaked blade is plunged deep within. Fission runs red unbearable. Agony triggers unconscious screams of primal, nearby animalistic torment. Stinkly reaches up to pull the scissors out, but just protection light that causes new jolts of torturous misery to flow through her body. But, ugh. Son of foreign object scrape against her cranium echoes through her mind mercilessly. Not from her eardrums, but directly to her brain. Oh god. This game is so fucking dark. No other experience could possibly have prepared her for this. It's all the suffering of the world can coalesce in one single moment. Ah. Ah. Pain grows exponentially worse with each heartbeat. Yet the trauma the experience makes the heartbeat faster, creating an endless cycle. Not something you can adapt to. It's not something you can ignore. All you can do is thank heaven above when you finally die. Don't tell me that was a wrong end. Tell me that was a wrong end, actually. I'd rather not have it be the right end. That was disgustingly graphic. Oh, thank God. I did not want to have that girl end like that. That's, uh, that'd be unimaginable. Anyways, um, that was sickening. So, we're going to end this episode. If you liked the video, don't forget to like the video. Subscribe if you'd like to see me squirm with all this. Oh, God, I don't even know. Ugh. Um, I'll see you in the next video, maybe. Bye.